Okay, I got, I got a word from the Lord. I was just trying to get down the street, but you know, the Lord started breathing on me. He started, started talking to me. So I don't think y'all gonna like what he gonna say. Don't sound good to me, but I'm gonna say it anyway. Thus says the Lord. No more plotting against my son. But some of you will be buried next to the people you have already buried. Thus says the Lord. I am now angry, furious, and my wrath is kindled upon you. Some of, you, some of you will be carried to your own judgment if you, can, if you decide to continue. Says the Lord. Nothing will harm my son. Why don't you understand that? You're going to. I will be sure of it. Your grave will be your own thought pattern. I will destroy you little by little. None will come to grips with their own sanity. None will think clearly ever again. It come. to do my servant David harm. Hey, the Lord telling me to tell y'all, yes, I am King David, me, that's what he called me. David never lost a battle, if you read your Bible. But I hear the Lord saying, okay. The Lord said to let you know what happened to Saul. He kept coming against David and he lost his mind. So they end up dying, physically. Start going to witches and warlocks. Because he couldn't get a word from a prophet. He couldn't hear from God no more. He was working for God, but he was fired at the same time. And the Lord said, I am going to remove the remaining of you from the face of the earth. He said, speak the judgment of Yah unto death unto them. I speak the judgment of Yah unto death unto you, upon you. You shall go no further as of this day. You shall die. Your days are numbered. Be obedient and receive this judgment. I command you to die. I command you to die. All of who want my son to die shall be no more. There shall be weeping and gnashing of teeth where you're going. Whom you serve, you shall meet. That is the word of judgment unto you. I warned you. Stop plotting against my son. Stop working voodoo against my son. Stop antagonizing my son. Stop stealing from my son. Stop bothering from my son. Stop harming my son with no sleep. You know you owe him. You know you took from him. Why not give him what is due before I give you what is due? And what it's due to you is death, because that's what your ultimate goal for my son is. So therefore, it is now your portion. You shall soon die. 
That is the word of the Lord.